How you doing? This is a reading for you for the 11th of July through to the 18th of July. Oh, whoopsie. So we're going back to the, going back to the classic, traditional, Rider Waite. And let's see what the Tarot wants you to know. I'm just going to cut them and take them. Cut them and take them. Wow, you've got the Emperor. <laughs> um, Gemini just had the Emperor second card in. And I've like shuffled them like 20 million times. Ooh. So some sort of controlling influence is bringing about a level of hardship. Let's see. Let's see what the next card is. Ooh, the Emperor and the Empress with the Five of Pentacles in the middle. Well, okay, so one good thing about this card is it does represent an opportunity to reverse your fortunes. It has messages of don't draw attention to your weaknesses. This is a leper here. These are lepers with a leper's bell. It also is a card of being left outside in the cold. The Emperor, the Five of Pentacles and the Empress. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to say it because just of those three cards, just of these three, I am getting the message. Oh, that one's in the middle. I am getting the message to say that if. It, it, okay, it's coming across like a relationship that is having problems, but a relationship that is meant to be good. Now, obviously, all relationships take work. Of course they do. But it's the Emperor and the Empress, the two most powerful divine counterparts in the entire deck. Okay, Libra? So is there something that's meant for you that you've accidentally had an emotional outburst upon and kind of made things tricky for yourself? Wow, okay. I've got the Nine of Swords. So it looks like you have. Nine of Swords, The Hanged Man. There has been some sort of argument, and you need to look at things from a different perspective. It's not about who's right or who's wrong. Wow, quite similar to the Gemini reading, has to be said. Willpower and victory and being divinely guided. Looking at things from another perspective and being divinely guided to do so. Like, the energy that I'm getting is this, Libra. You're thinking of leaving someone. And I don't think this reading is, is saying that you should. I think this reading is saying that you should... Um, times may have been tough, times may have been hard. But really think long and hard. Look at your relationship from another perspective. Things have been difficult, of course. Of course, they are in relationships. Yes, okay. So the Emperor, this is underneath the Emperor, the Emperor is sad and you are anxious. Ace of Pentacles, underneath the Five of Pentacles, I said an opportunity to turn around your financial situation. I think that's what it is. You guys are meant to be together, but money is has become a real problem in just like the last month or two. Something's happened. You made an investment in something or you lo and you lost an, an amount of money temperance under the empress you lost a certain amount of money and um, it's put an enormous amount of pressure on the relationship it's created arguments and I think you're both regretting the way that you have both spoken to each other this is you and your partner Libra okay and this, I, the, the energy I'm getting from this is this is asking you to come back together. I mean, it's not a message that I often get in a reading, to be honest, but I am getting it, so I'm saying it. Wish come true. You don't want to really not be with this person. It's your dream and your wish to be with this person. Choices, choices, choices. 
abundance will be coming in. You will have plenty to buy jewels and trinkets and victories. But maybe don't buy the snake or the go the goblin thing. It's a dragon. Ah, okay, nice. With, ah, I'm guessing with revitalized health, wealth and prosperity, you can be moving on. Moving on together, if you choose, if you so choose. Make a wish, make a wish right now. Okay, so as above the emperor, so below, five of pentacles, five of cups, sorry. <laughs> as above the five of pentacles, so below the ace of pentacles. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. So the emperor's money, so, so the man or the woman in your life, whoever is taking on that energy, they've come across financial hardship and it's put pressure on the relationship in a big way. As above the empress, so below temperance. As above the nine of swords, so below the nine of cups, two nines. So go and look up the angel number, 99, and that can help you key on the energy of the reading. As above the hanged man, so below the seven of cups. And I like this outro energy. As above the chariot, so below the page of wands. Okay, Libra, thanks for being here. Take care. Bye. Oh, <laughs>